Welcome to Cat and Raven Designs. I'm Cat, and I'm Raven. And today, as you've probably gathered from the thumbnail, we are doing another one of our YouTuber fan series soaps. And today we are doing Mariah Elizabeth. <laughs> Excellent. Who is a uh, very big channel here in my household? We uh, we watch a lot of Mariah Elizabeth, a lot. Pretty much every day, it's becoming a habit of my kids before they go to bed, they want to watch Mariah. <laughs> I think my son's favorite thing is the squishy roasting. Yeah, he does really like that. Doesn't sit through, sit still through any of the rest of the video, except for the <laughs> squishy roasting. What does that say about my child? Uh, he likes to critique things? I don't know. As just a quick reminder, if you have never been to one of our fan series before, I'm going to go ahead and put a link up in the iCard there to the previous fan series that we've done. This is number four. So we've done Nerdy Crafter, Jeffree Star, Jenna Marbles, and now Mariah Elizabeth. Um, we do not sell our fan series soaps because they're based on a person as a gift and also on their IP. And it just feels kind of wrong to, to sell those. Yeah. Um, but we do a giveaway every time we have these. So we'll send about seven of the 10 bars we'll make today to Mariah. We'll hang on to three to do a giveaway. So keep an eye out for that coming later. Shall we? Okay. So we have got our oils and we have got our lye water solution with the uh, sodium lactate already mixed in. And if you're new to soap making, this is sodium hydroxide, which is lye mixed with distilled water. And then sodium lactate helps the bars harden up. So how best to distill Mariah Elizabeth down into one soap design? And I feel like the obvious first answer to that question. The rainbow. 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 So much rainbow. Which is why we're wanting this to be a little bit liquidy so we can separate out the layers. So am I... You separate? I separate. Yes. Raven is better at this part than I am. She, I, I'm more chaos. She's more precision. So we can let the precise thing go to key. To Raven now. Before we start doing our colors here, our fragrance today for Miss Mariah is Strawberry Shortcake, which does discolor. So we are going to be mixing that with some vanilla color stabilizer so that way it doesn't turn brown. We want those colors to stay nice and rainbowy and pretty. Part of why the sodium lactate is so important is the vanilla color stabilizer, though it has been very successful for us in keeping colors true to what we want. It also makes the soap really soft. So our first color is going to be iris purple. All the colors, pretty good chance, are going to have to be mixed with titanium di dioxide, which I have waiting off camera here. Tiny blender! Tiny blender! Fan favorite tiny blender. <laughs> that fragrance smells fan. Fantastic. <laughs> Catch yourself there, cat. I haven't heard Mariah swear in one of her videos. I will try to not swear in this one. <laughs> oh, I already did it, didn't I? Yeah, you usually do. Okay, I, I was I was gonna try, guys. I really was. <laughs> Sorry, let's make this pastel. Mm -hmm. I know it smells really good. Mm -hmm. It's like a, it's definitely got the strawberry, but then it's got that nice warm cakey smell to it. It's really nice. So now I'm gonna try doing something that I've seen Katie do. We've tried it once to mixed results, mm -hmm. but we kind of want to try this again. Cause while we can't blend the colors like Mariah does, I wanted to get something in there that kind of represented blending. There we go. Really? What? Really? <laughs> Y'all, you thought I was the agent of chaos? Somebody gave Raven googly eyes. <laughs> All right, next up, we're gonna be mixing up some sky blue. All right, well, we'll wait for that to set up. I'm gonna go ahead and mix up the next color, which is gonna be the Maniacal P from Mad Maggots. That's looking nice. Put some titanium in that. So in the next color we shall be using is also Mad Micas. We're going to be using Banana Split. Mm. Ooh la la. Come on. Look at that. Good job, Mad Micas. Do, 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 do. <laughs> do, 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 do. 
Doo -doo 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 -doo. Well, if that isn't chicken family yellow, I don't know what is. Although, admittedly, if we're going to talk about, like, favorite squishies that Mariah's done, for me, it's the polar bear family. They're so cute. Me, it's the um, unicorn floaty. I think Allie might really love pickle, because I ordered pickle for her. We got in on the pre-order for pickle, and she keeps being like, when, when, uh, when will pickle be here? Uh, I would like pickle now, please. When will pickle be here? And I'm like, June. Pickle will be here in June. So our next color is also Mad Micah's. Tequila Sunrise. Tequila! It's very pretty. Down to our last color. Chubby. Flower Girl. Boy, this is really liquidy. Why are you doing us like this soap? I hate waiting. Me too. Sitting there letting them watch soap dry. But come on, a pastel pink skull. Yeah, this smells like strawberry shortcake. All right, so we are ready to go ahead and start mixing up our frosting, which is a slightly different recipe than our base, but the basic construction is the same. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with our what do you, so down there. Lye water. So our wedding with lye water. And I'm also gonna go ahead and mix our titanium dioxide mixed with water, just straight in here. And let's blend. So we're gonna let this bad boy set up and we will come back to pipe. So we're back. We have our frosting in our bag with our round tip. And we are ready to start piping. So I think maybe one of the things that is the hardest part about doing these fan soaps is trying to match the editing style of someone else. I've been trying to figure out in my head, how am I going to make this reminiscent of Mariah and her videos? And then like when I think Jackie was having the same problem when she, or the same conversation, I suppose would be the right word when she was getting ready to do her rain boa for Mariah. Jackie's <laughs> series is so much fun. Where <laughs> she's like, I'm gonna have to use a lot of poop noises because Mariah has fart noises in hers, <laughs> which I'm not looking forward to, let me tell you. Yes! <laughs> I am looking forward to this. I feel like Allie is going to wig out about this because yeah. she's such a huge Mariah fan. So, Mariah, if you see this, my six year old <laughs> is completely in love with your channel. We have to watch Mariah Elizabeth every night before she goes to bed. <laughs> every night. Every night. Her favorite lately has been the Bake With Me series. She really likes that one. Two. So tonight she was all about that painting on those palettes. Yeah. Painting on the, the paint palettes. Yeah. I mean, I will fully admit I'm also a Mariah Elizabeth fan. I think her channel is really fun. We got a thing. Mad Micah's. Sparkle me aqua. We couldn't help it after watching Katie use it so many times. We finally decided we had to try it. It really is pretty though. I'm, I mean, and that's coming from the glitter police here. See, it's so pretty, so shiny. It's, it's almost less like a glitter and more like a glossy coat. Yes. So let's talk about embeds, shall we? So first off, to go on top, we have some cherries. Because Mariah does like to do a cute little cherry on top. And next up, to go along with the strawberry shortcake, we have strawberry embeds. So these are from a custom made uh, mold that we made ourselves from real strawberries. So they are super realistic looking. Last but certainly not least, it would not be a Mariah Elizabeth without sprinkles. So these are handmade soap dough sprinkles made in the exact same uh, technique that Mariah used to make her own polymer sprinkles. So we're going to uh, go ahead and how about this? We will cue the sprinkle song. I feel like I want to note two things about the sprinkles. Number one, this is giving me 
a newfound respect for the amount of work that Mariah puts into putting sprinkles on things. Because, God, this is a lot of work. Uh, number two, if we ever do soap sprinkles on something again, um, we're just going to toss them on there. Sorry. I do just a little bit of hollow glitter, and this is, again, biodegradable. All of our glitters are always biodegradable glitter. This is uh, silver hollow from Nurture Soap. Just to set off those embeds just a little bit. And with that, the Mariah Elizabeth bars are done. I am so excited. I think these look so cute. Look at this, so great. So we will go ahead and let this sit for about 24 hours again, and uh, we will come back and cut them up into bars. And we also have some little bonus bars. This one is scented. The pink underneath is gonna be scented, but uh, this top part isn't. And these other ones will be unscented that we'll be able to just give out to folks. So that'll be fun. All right, so if there is an ad with YouTube available, that might come up here in a second. Otherwise, we're gonna go ahead and catch you in a minute. Okay, so here is a side view of how this is coming out. Looking so pretty. Okay, how are we looking? Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay, okay, okay. I like that. Look at that. That looks so cute. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm trying to do Mariah proud here. God, those look colors look fantastic. I know. I'm so excited. I think we did her proud. I think we did her proud. I, I think we did too. Hopefully uh, she will get the chance to see this video. Speaking of which, so we have done, this is number four of our YouTuber fan series. Uh, so Jackie was our first one. Jackie absolutely 100% was aware of the video. <laughs> she got her soap. She even unboxed them on film, which was amazing. It was so cool to see her do that. Um, the other two that we did before this for Jeffree Star and Jenna Marbles, at the time of filming this, we absolutely sent bars to Jeffrey. Um, never heard anything, but you know, that's honestly kind of to be expected. Jenna, we still don't know if she ever saw it. I don't think she did, but she doesn't have an open PO box the way some other YouTubers do. So we haven't sent the bars to her because, you know, we want to respect her privacy and... If she doesn't want to have a P.O. box because she doesn't want to have a bunch of stuff sent to her, that's totally within her right, and we want to respect that. Um, so we still have the Kermit bars. Uh, Mariah has a P.O. box, so hopefully we can get these off to her and it doesn't turn into, like, eight months later she sees them. <laughs> but hopefully she sees this, you know. Again, Mariah, we're, we're big fans. This looks so cute. I mean, look at these little sprinkles. How can I not love that? This is why I'm being silent because the smell, I'm just like, yes, just, just waft over me scent of this soap. <laughs> just waft over me. Oh, look at this texture though. So cute. That was Kat's idea. Kat had a good idea. Not that Kat doesn't normally have good ideas. <laughs> I'm about to say, I'm full of good yeah, ideas. Chock full of them. I'm just saying this is another one to add to the list of good ideas that Kat has had. So the only thing I have concerns about right now, and you can kind of see it a lot better on the end here, but like, this is what the end looks like. <laughs> Where the colors are all jacked. So hopefully it doesn't stay that way. I mean, come on. Come on. How cute are these? I love it. Me too. I think it's amazing. I'm so happy with it. This is probably my favorite design we've done so far this year. Mine too. This is great. I love it so much. Okay, so what do y'all think? Did we do Mariah Elizabeth Justice? I mean, we got the cherry. We got the strawberry. We got the sprinkles. We got the glitter. We got the pastel rainbow. I mean, come on. This looks awesome. Okay. <laughs> I'm so pleased. So we're going to let these cure for about four weeks. And then we will be doing a giveaway for three of the bars like we normally do. And uh, these little sample bits will end up going into the rotation. 
So uh, keep an eye out for those when it gets a little closer to the giveaway time. So uh, we'll also, if we need to, I'll throw in a little extra clip at the end um, if we need to do any kind of updating in terms of how the colors fared during the curing process. I think they're gonna be just fine. In the meantime, uh, we will catch you for the next video. We always update on Saturdays. You can get our soaps at catandravendesigns.com. Uh, we'd also appreciate it if you comment, like, subscribe, you know, the usual YouTube thing. We're also Cat and Raven Designs on Facebook and Instagram, and we are Cat and Raven on TikTok. All right, so this looks great. All right, we'll catch you next time. Bye, everybody.